Science Central in Fort Wayne offers various learning activities and experiments for visitors of all ages. But today, Martin Fisher himself of Science Central is here with us for another morning of Science Sunday. You're coming to us. Good, what good morning. Good morning. What do we have here? I have some basic science of light experiments. You know, it's kind of bad weather outside, crummy, cold. I hope that you'll want to go to Science Central. But if you don't, you decide to huddle at home with your friends and family, here are some simple science of light activities you can try and you guys will help out. Okay. All right, for the first one, you're going to need a glass, something that you can magnify. And I'm going to use a penny. Okay. We'll put that in the bottom. And then a little bit of plastic wrap or saran wrap. You'll put that on top. And then you're going to want to cave it in just a little bit. Okay. Because what we're going to do is put a couple of drops of water on the top of the saran wrap. This is the setup. As the camera zooms in, you can see what you need. However, I realize at home you're not going to be able to see this, but you guys should be able to look through the so water making and your you own should magnifying see glass, right? that the penny is magnified. Yeah. What's happening oh, yeah. is the water is creating a concave yeah. lens. That's a curved lens. And what it's doing is it's magnifying the penny that we have on the inside. So Very there cool. we go. So do it yourself magnifying glass. Right. Yeah. Huh. So here's the next one that you can try. Oh. Don't spill oh. on the iPad. <laughs> right on the iPad. <laughs> right on technology. Water and electricity. Uh -oh. Bad mix. We're good. All yeah, right, so good. here's the next one. Science of light. We're going to talk about refraction. Okay. Refraction is when light bends as it passes from one material to another. So little happy light beam moves along, and it goes from air to water. It bends. It changes direction. Or it goes from water to plastic. It bends. It changes direction. All you need to do is, once again, use your trusty glass, fill it with water, drop in a pencil, and if the camera zooms in, it should appear as if our pencil is bent. Okay. It appears as if it's at a, yeah, there I'll, you can I'll see try it. to turn it. That is something. And, and you know, you do notice those things on like day to day life if you're, you know, a straw or something like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. And there is actually science the, behind that. That's it. Isn't it's that because as the water, as the air, excuse me, as the light is going from air to glass to water to glass and out again, each time it's bending, it's changing its direction. And that's why it looks like the pencil is bent. And I'm going to try to turn it sideways. If the camera zooms in one more time, You'll also be able to see that bent look oh, yeah. from mm -hmm. the from top of the water from different angles. Very cool. These are easy activities that you can try at home. Very simple, very safe, as long as you don't pour the water on the iPad. <laughs> on the iPad, which I did not do. She didn't do it. I'm and you still have lots of activities going on, of course, at Science do, Central. Yeah, Today's the last day for spring break. Exactly. So we're open from 12 to 5. We are going to be going back to our regular hours this week, which means we're closed Mondays and Tuesdays except for field trips, and then open the rest of the week. But if you were to come in today, you'll be able to see all of our demonstrations, our electricity programs, our weather demonstration, of course, your Love favorite. Weather. Yep. You'll be no, able you to don't. see the new exhibits <laughs> that we have. We just opened up a whole bunch of new exhibits about engineering, structures, architecture, design, and you'll be able to try those as well. Martin Very Fisher, cool. thank you so much for coming in. Always a pleasure. pleasure. And as we mentioned, you and your family can check out Science Central Wednesday through Sunday. That's located on Clinton Street. We're back with more news and weather after the break.